So just as I mentioned yesterday, Samsung likes to do certain things a bit differently than other smartphone manufacturers. Most Android devices have what is known as fast boot mode. And it's in this fast boot mode that you can use certain fast boot commands that come along with the ADB tool. That's why you usually see these tools called ADB and fast boot because they come together. However, Samsung does not have fast boot mode on their devices. Instead, they have what a lot of people refer to as download mode, which can also be referred to as Odin mode. A lot of people will call this Odin mode because that's what you need. This is the special boot mode that you need to boot into in order to interface with the computer program called Odin. But again, technically it's called download mode. And again, Samsung has changed things up compared to even the Galaxy S9 and the Galaxy S9 Plus. Before we were able to get into download mode by pressing and holding some buttons while going through the boot up sequence, that is no longer possible with the Galaxy Note 9. So today I'm going to show you the new way to boot the Galaxy Note 9 into download mode. So to start off, we're going to first need to power off the device. So we're just going to press and hold the power button for a few seconds. Tap the power off option. And then wait until the device completely shuts down. Once the Galaxy Note 9 has completely shut down, we're going to need our, to grab our USB Type-C cable, which is currently connected to our PC. And then we're going to need to press and hold both the Bixby and the Volume Down buttons at the same time. With those two buttons held down, continue holding them, and then insert the USB Type-C cable in the device. If done properly, you're going to see that the smartphone has then booted up into the splash screen for download mode. Now this is where things start to get more familiar. This is the splash screen for download mode. Now if we get here by accident, if for somehow you did all of that by accident, you can just press the volume down button and it will cancel booting into download mode, which means it will restart the phone and you'll boot back up into Android. However, you most likely want to continue. So we're going to press on the volume up button and that's going to bring us right into download mode. This is download mode and you're going to see this warning that says downloading do not turn off target. That is a fake warning unless you have initiated something with a program like Odin. Like right now I can power off and restart this device and there will not be any harm done to the Galaxy Note 9. Now if I had started to flash a new firmware or a modem or bootloader or anything else with Odin and while that install was happening I then turned off and restarted the Galaxy Note 9, then there would be, would be some issues. But right now you can see we are in download mode. This is where basically it this tutorial ends because this is where we want to go. We want to get into download mode. I do this because I refer to booting into download mode in multiple tutorials depending on if I'm showing you how to manually update to a new version of Android or if I'm just telling you how to downgrade to a previous version of Android or even if I'm just showing you how to return back to stock Samsung experience version of Android and there you have it that is how to boot the Samsung Galaxy Note 9
into download mode, which again is also known as Odin mode. 